Hey everybody! So this week we're reading a story about the little engine that could and how she's so small but she tries to carry that very heavy train over the mountain. And I thought we could learn a little bit about things that are heavy and light and how we measure them. So what we did in our Zoom this morning um, was we made scales and I thought I'd show you how to do it in case you missed it. So you're going to need a hanger, okay? ideally one with like little notches but if you don't have that, that's okay. And you're gonna need some string or yarn. And then you're gonna need um, some two of the same cup. Now, you can use a paper cup, a plastic cup, you can use a real cup that you have in your house. Um, if you are using a plastic one, you can punch a little hole in the side, two sides, and then uh, string the string through it. Um, or you can do what I did over here, where I used a rubber band. Um, and I just tied the string around the rubber band. Okay, so you wanna have two cups like this. Okay, the two pieces of string, we wanna try to make them the same. Okay, and then we're gonna hang them up on our finger, like, like <laughs> this. Okay, and then we need to find a spot to hang it so we can measure. So I have mine on a little screw in the wall here, but you can also hang yours on a doorknob, or the back of a chair, or anything that can kind of hold that little lip of the hanger. It's important to hold it from here, because that's how we see which side is heavier. Okay, now this is the fun part. We get to measure different things. So you can collect some small things from around your house. Um, maybe you have two different seashells, and you want to see which one is heavier. So you put one in one side, and you see when it goes down like that, that's how you know it's heavier. Put one in the side. Cool. This one looks like this one is a little bit heavier. Now our friends are gonna love to fill these cups with things. So let's try to count things out and figure out how to match them that way. So let's see, I have a block. Now I think this block is gonna be heavy, um, but I wonder how heavy. So I'm gonna put that in there. Hmm. And then I have pennies. Now I wonder how many pennies is it gonna take to be as heavy as the block? And I'm gonna count them out. One, two, three, four, five. I think that is about even. So I'm gonna say it's five pennies are as heavy as one block. This is a great pre-math skill and counting skill. And there are so many fun things that you can measure out here. You can count out which side, um, how many of one thing you need to be as heavy as another one. Or you can just try to see how heavy can you get it to go. So I hope you guys have fun with your scales and fun measuring today, and we'll see you again later.